What happens when you do parkour in each of the Rockstar games? We start with GTA 3, where it's already possible to do parkour using different cars and also the rooftops in the game. In GTA Vice City, there was a slight improvement in animations as now Tommy rolls when he lands. In GTA San Andreas, CJ can easily climb onto rooftops thanks to his reach. He can also jump from rooftop to rooftop but cannot climb on cars. In GTA 4, there's a significant improvement in building structures as they are now more suitable for parkour. In Red Dead Redemption, John Marston will have a lot of difficulty climbing buildings and when he jumps, he falls flat on his face. In L.A. Noir, we find Agent Cole Phelps, and in the game, he is quite agile and can perform several stunts on rooftops. In GTA 5, our character has an easier time descending buildings. He can step over railings and almost climb onto all platforms of his height. In Red Dead Redemption 2, Parker is similar to GTA 5. Arthur Morgan can climb all buildings of his height, but his jumps lack the power to execute good Parker. 